course of the help of the tournament. So we need sort of strategy for the next part. And now he's just, well, sitting and waiting. What the hell? So disrespectful, in my opinion. Really now. <sighs> okay, combination. Look at this brilliancy. Next one. First win. So, I mean, in a new streak. Let's try to build the new streak. We're actually not in a rush because, as I said, there is still one hour. Have a lot of time, but at the same time we have to be quite efficient. Otherwise, somebody can just grab all the points. There will be no chance for us to fight for the prizes. Link to India. Indian defense. Okay. Typical maneuver to bring the knight to g6. have a chance to actually chase that bishop on g5 so from g6 the knight will actually grab h4 square and so on okay what is this preparation of the b4 seemingly let's continue with the plan let's just continue with the plan forced all right that should be still better even in this position after all these simplifications why should be still better so this e4 is just a liability on this and it's hanging right now so i have to do something ugly like from h4 On the other hand, okay, I have a clear plan. I'm gonna play at five, at four. It's so probably for K1. I just capture it and forget about the queen side and just completely focus on the, on the king side. Yeah, that is exactly what I was talking about. In any case, it looks like my best chance to play there. Sorry, sorry, my friend, but there is this simple tactics and takes the queen. 
that is the queen. Okay. Second win in this new streak. Let's go further. Let us go further. <clears throat> Rui Lopez with the D3. Okay, D6 is acceptable and playable. solid position. Alright, knight to d7. Now I think it's a good time for us to play d4, in fact. Just creating some pressure. F5? No, I don't think it's a good idea. It just weakens a lot. It just weakens a lot. There should be something tactical. Reminds me of the old game of Capablanca. What about something simple like this? Oh, seriously, okay. Okay, thank you. So now it's definitely lost for black, but we still have to win this. So, how to win this? Convincing. Take the pawn. Check. No, my friend, that is not how chess works. Too many blunders. Too many blunders. Extra rook now. Extra rook. Time to resign. Time to resign. Let's grab the queen. No, these guys are playing till the very end. Wow. Okay, it's understandable the guy is rated like 1700s. Let's keep on playing. So the third win in this trick. And now it's here is opponent. 2300s. It's really aggressive. It's really aggressive. As far as I remember, it's possible to grab this one or to play C4 immediately. I don't remember what is the trick there. Be like the same. Okay. I'm fine here. There's two extra pawns, right?
Now it's time to complete the development somehow. Alright, 94 is possible, I guess. Yep. Let's do it. And here is our development. Completed. I'm not sure where Baster, why do you have a black screen? It's on my end it looks it looks like working. So I have no idea what happened. And by the way it's a winning position. So extra material and now I will have even more of that. Rogue G3, it's not clear what to do. Now probably just just like this. Maybe I'm missing something. Maybe H3 was better immediately. Didn't know. Hmm. Hmm. Nice trick. Nice trick, by the way. Okay, let's take this. are still winning. Okay, maybe not that convincingly as I wanted, but should be still winning. To connect it on should be should be black, I think. Oops. Misplayed even this. Look at this. Even this. Okay, we lost another streak, and that was just a fantastic, fantastic blow. <laughs> Amazing. How can International Master actually uh, fuck up a position like this? 
unthinkable. Should also repeat the serial hook endings. <laughs> So quite aggressive approach, quite active setup. I like this position. Pawn on e7 is fixed. A constant problem for black. It's also important to put the pieces on right squares. So let's start with this group. This is what I wanted to do. A5. sure if it is anything specific behind it but looks nice to force the key in here now it's okay partner just to come back the key in there looks a bit misplaced Knight C4 move at all. I mean, I'm not sure what what is going on. Probably again, I'm just missing the pawn. Oh my god! Oh my god! I keep on playing the bullshit. Just keep on playing the bullshit. Our mistake here is just attack this guy. I regain the minor piece here, and the pawn structure is not that great for black. My bishop starts working, actually. I was curious if I can activate this bishop at some point, and it looks like I managed to achieve something. Alright, now let's take on b5 with the bishop. going to exchange queens here. This position looks just amazing for me. But where is my wing?
Yeah, I was not very convincing, but at least I won the game, right? At least I won the game. So uh, slightly less than 40 minutes are left. Time to achieve something. Try to come up. Time to come up with a new streak. <laughs> Otherwise, it will be nothing. In the sense of prizes. Knight c6, okay, e3. This has good game. It was not. In fact, it was not a good game. I blundered several times. I didn't tell you guys about that, but <clears> there <throat> was a good way for my opponent to improve his game. Playing even this, I said that now what am I doing here? Not sure. Bishop is strong. Constructor should be slightly better for me, but this bishop is quite good. I'm struggling because of that. But this is this sort of help, I think, or maybe not. Maybe it is not. Maybe it is not. Maybe it is. You know. Not so clear. Knight mm, to F four. Knight is gonna. Occupy what? D3, I guess. So let's attack C3. Hmm. But I can take here anyway. <clears throat> that was the idea. Alright, I thought he would take on C3. That was a mistake. Um. I think this is the most promising anyway. No, it was not. Too many mistakes. Just too many mistakes. My play is quite bad. is quite bad tonight. Okay, what to do now?
this a nice checkmate, right? At least something. Something satisfactory. Okay, Fuxia, good luck. Thank you for being here. <clears throat> The dragon is met with something <coughs> calm and solid. Okay, this queen e2 was a bit stupid because I anyway didn't have the threat of taking on e7, so should have probably played something else. Alright, but this is Or maybe rook c5 after that. It's unclear. If I can capture there in general. Okay, let's play Queen D3 protected D5. Now I have a threat of taking on a5. And I have a sort of taking on e7 as well. Bishop f5 actually <laughs> solves both problems, and I somehow missed this one. Yeah. My play in this game is just uh, very bad. Fortunately, I didn't make a critical mistake, so. Still having some pressure in Black's position. Okay, B5. So Rook is under attack, is he gonna sacrifice something here, or just keep on playing normal chess? I'm not sure. Rook e4. Okay, probably, probably a good decision. Some. I don't like my position at all, and I hate this game. He decided not to win the material, I guess. Metal Eagle says, you're tired. If your play is not as sharp as usual, yeah, that's right, absolutely. So, I'm playing not convincingly at all. That's true. That's true. So actually, everything started very nice. I managed to beat Hammer, but then at some point, I started misplaying many games. There are still some chances. Though, but they are now very tiny.
<clears throat> so somehow my opponent started thinking too much. Now I win some material, I guess. Now I win some material. The position remains quite complicated, I guess. But after this, I come up with a simplification. Right, streak three. Three wins in a row. The best six in a row. So let's keep on doing. Let's keep on doing the thing. We have 25 minutes left. Mm, let's try to be slightly more aggressive. Let's try to be slightly more aggressive. faster. Let's try to make decisions faster. Alright, now I see what is not fighting for advantage, I think, or at least I don't understand how is it possible to fight for advantage this way. So let's separate b5 and a3, preparing some like queen a5 at some point. Bishops, no problems at all. All these pieces are potentially misplaced, but maybe I'm overestimating my chances. So first of all, we have to solve the problem of the bishop because it is quite, quite badly placed there. And also this one on C8 is something that we should solve quickly. Extra minor piece. Extra minor piece now. Let's put the knight in this central square. I know I could have probably captured on a3, but I want to just complete the development. Special on c8 is still not very inspiring, guy. Okay. Probably queen goes to the center. Queen goes to the center. Knight to d3. Now I think it's time to capture this. <coughs> so I improved my position a bit. Now it's time to grab some material. Why not? Rook c4. What's going on? Not quite sure. Rook 
What about promoting this pawn? Okay, there is no queen f2. Because knight protects it, but ed5 is just good enough. Grabbing the rook on g4. Okay, man, it's time to resign. Come on. No. He's playing till the end. He's just a true fighter. He's just a true fighter, this guy. Alright. It is just smashing. <laughs> okay. Streak 4. And super strong opponent. Greek or Mehitarian. Grandmaster. Streamer. Simply great guy. <clears throat> and I'm misplaying it simply. Of course, knight a5 and then b4. That's how it is played. Stupid me. Just confuse the move order. My position is still not that entirely bad. Still have some compensation for all this. About this. Okay. Now e5 is hitting, that's the problem. But I can try this. And this. No. No, it's just amazing. I, I'm just blundering everything here. But fortunately, I have bishop f5. I mean, taking on d5 was just losing the piece on e7. Fortunately, I have bishop f5. I didn't see that. Okay, we still have some chances. Still have some chances to fight. Because these double pawns are not that sexy. <laughs> so... I have some squares here, so for example, d6 can be used as an outpost later. And, well, white decides to give me a chance to capture in d5. I think I probably have to. Now the knight is under pressure, and knight e5 is coming. That, that's the problem. How to play this correctly? Knight to c3, maybe. Too risky, but... My position is anyway very bad, so let's try that. No, that is too much. Bishop f6 first. Yeah, everything is protected, even overprotected there. Very strange position. Very strange one. Got his queen. <coughs> that 
I wish only almost. Some tricks. I've got some tricks. Look at this. Rook B2, knight D3. We're gaining the material. Very nice. We've been winning some. We've been winning some. Here we go. All right, this is win, big win, streak five. Streak five now. Let's keep on playing. We have some chances. We have some chances. Still some chances. Thirteen minutes only. Current position number five. Not very inspiring, but. I don't remember. Maybe there are some non-title players ahead. So okay, at very least I just managed to beat two grandmasters this night. Also, sort of result, right? Also, sort of result. Why didn't I take on d5? My goodness. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. It was possible to do. It's just fun. Now it's lost completely. My goodness. That's, that is just fantastic. How can you display the position like in several moves? That's amazing. Just a cheap bluff and yeah, very bad. Okay. 
okay. But anyway, there are no chances in this game, probably I have to resign. Oh! What the hell is that? Okay, thank you. <laughs> okay, thank you. That's fantastic, that was just a great present. He resigns, I don't understand what is that, I was like talking about res resignation, but he decided to resign himself. Oh, nice. Okay, Creek War again. Creek War again. That's interesting. So the second game against the same guy. It's possible when you play Arena. It's possible when you play Arena. That was, that was something. Super strange. I mean, I don't understand that at all. Question: You Russian? No, I'm not. <clears throat> I'm Ukrainian. Ninety-five. Rook eight super attacks and b two, and just preparing the development of the bishop. Question is where to put it. Probably e3 is not that bad square. Queen b8. Yeah, it's probably Queen F3 wasn't that great, I would say. Now my position sucks, simply. Simply sucks. Alright, let's try to survive it. It'll be very hard. Sweet tooth black man, I don't answer stupid question. Alright, at all. So you can type whatever you want there, I will just ignore you, starting from this very moment. <clears throat> yeah, position is not that great. Honestly, it's just, just bad. It's just bad. But since his pieces are not that active yet, I think I, I still have some chances. it's a good idea to simplify it a bit maybe it's a good idea to simplify it a bit probably rook to b6 right now isn't that bad rook c4 but only four is hanging that's that's annoying okay but we also get some some materials so. oh that was just a big blunder That was just a big blunder. Why did I do that? I have no idea. Mm, too many threats. Too many threats here. So it's basically lost. 
basically lost. some tiny chances still of course but I don't I don't really believe in this oh blundered another rook oh he didn't notice that fantastic just a great lock here in this game actually Queen takes d7 and it's over No chance. All right, resign. I deserved, of course, losing this game for sure. Okay, and we lost our streak. We lost our streak, which is very bad. Now I think uh, it's really, really hard to fight for anything. All right. So three minutes only, I think this game will not really change anything because uh, I'm not gonna even finish it. But who knows, maybe maybe there will be something. We will see. So sixth place, which is quite sad, but who knows, I don't know who is there. Um, probably there are some non-titled players ahead as well which means that well there is a tiny chance that i will actually fight for maybe third prize or something like this because uh the system of uh, prize awarding here is that uh, there is a uh, separated awarding for titled players and non-titled ones and somehow i managed to get not that bad position so i want to play h5 Trapping the bishop, with h6 or h5, then I just take the bishop and damage the pawn structure. Knight e4, but I can still play this. And the bishop is almost trapped for right. Six. and f6 probably is his idea but it's anyway very very dubious position after f6 it doesn't really help I just take on c6 first and then go away with the bishop so his bishop is trapped all right so let's take it so extra minor piece now but I'm not sure I'm gonna win this if he's a mean person he will wait because we have like one minute 14 seconds till the end of the game and the thing is until the end of the tournament so he can he can basically wait he can basically wait and uh, the game will be just aborted. Yeah, 
Yeah, only 30 seconds till the end of the tournament. It's unrealistic to win such a position. So quickly, unless he blunders something, but highly unlikely this will happen. Okay, 61 points, streak. Okay, so the first place and the second place and the third place are all guys that are actually non-titled. Wow, probably I just uh, won the prize even. Let's have a look. Let's have a look at the standings. So, first three places are guys that are non-titled players. Then there is uh, Robert Hess on the place number four, uh, my opponent from the last round on the place number five, uh, who is also not not a rate, uh, sorry, title player, and I am six. So basically, uh, Robert Hess takes the first title prize, and I take the second title prize. Uh, very nice. Not not that bad for such a uh, well. Uh, bad going tournament to be honest so at some point I started misplay and everything but uh, well actually during first I would say 15 20 games I was quite good actually beating hammer and so on uh, at some point uh, towards the end of the tournament I also managed to beat Creek or make it Tyrion, but then I actually lost the next game to him so not that bad result after all I would say so some money some bucks uh, very nice and well there are a lot of uh, interesting games as well uh, thanks for being me thanks for watching this and um, well don't forget to follow me on twitch don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel don't forget to follow me on twitter because it is the best way to be notified in time about any chess related activity of mine all the links can be found here below my name and well all the best guys uh, see you very very soon Hopefully. Bye-bye.